What is going on guys? It is your boy Wagner back at it again with another video and today for you guys um, I have got a very interesting review on uh, I think what you guys want to see is the Zenith X2E Plus Youth Football Helmet. Um, this is the Zenith X2E Plus $165.95 without tax. Yeah. So this is the Zenith X Tweet Plus Youth Football Helmet. I got it in small. So, as always with my helmet reviews, I am doing a review on safety, a review on comfort, and a review on price. So first of all, safety. We're going to jump right into this review. So, the Zenith X Tweet Plus offers a shock absorbing technology system of uh, shock absorbers. So... Let me show you this up close. As you can see, pardon my uh, my little thing, so I have to send it back. But this is the shock absorbers on the Zenith X to E Plus. They're all around the helmet. Some are like uh, some are bolted down, and some are free moving to reduce rotational uh, concussions. That in it scores very high on it scores high on the uh, NFL uh, technology safety test. So I'll put an image up right now that shows you that the test and how it scored the Zenith X2E Plus and it scored very high in that test. Um, yeah. So that is one of the features of the Zenith X2E Plus. And then another feature that is awesome is their. Uh, safety fitting um safety fitting technology so zenith does not have any air holes to pump up your helmet but it does have a technology to when you pull the chin strap like this the back of the helmet right here as you can see right here it comes forward and fits to the back of your head as you pull the chin strap so if i'm pulling the chin strap up the back of the helmet is clamping down on the back of my head so it has a tighter fit does not move the helmet is very comfortable and it does not move on my head so uh you know a um a well-fitted helmet is a safe helmet that's what i believe and uh yeah so um the zenith x 2 plus offers those two new and improved safety um features on their helmet so that is the safety section. Next is the comfort. So let me come up to the camera again with the helmet. So this is the Zenith X2E Plus. Oh my gosh, this thing keeps on getting in my sorry. So this is the comfort inside the Zenith X2E Plus. As you can see, there are air bubbles inside of the Zenith X2E Plus. These are air bubbles. So they're they're really cushiony, they're really comfortable. The jaw pads are also an air cushioned material. That kind of um, it's just a soft it's a soft material. It's a very soft material. Um, but as you can see, there's not that much padding in here. The padding is Velcro, so you can take it off. You can take it off. But as you can see, there's not much padding in here. A few bubbles. There's about five at the back five at the top you know a couple around not as much as my speed flex um there's not as much padding but the padding is comfortable um i like it i like it a lot i like i like the bubbles because it you, your head kind of molds to it right away um it's it's a very good design and a very uh well uh you know created feature by zenith so i give them props for that and then yeah, it's a very comfortable helmet. On a scale of one to ten, if the Speed Flex is a the uh, the comfort of the Speed Flex is a nine, I would say the Zenith is an eight. I would say the Zenith, yeah, because the Speed Flex is very comfortable and it has it has more padding than this. But I like that. Um, I like I like the air bubbles. I do, but it's just, it's just not enough. I think there should be more. I think it would add a little more comfort. You could find a way to put that in there. That's all I'd say for recommendations to Zenith. But yeah. And then also, 
for the comfort, this helmet is a lot lighter than the Speed Flex. If I'm holding a Speed Flex, let me get it. If I'm holding a Speed Flex right here, yeah, this helmet, yeah, it's a lot lighter. This helmet, it comes in around, I think, two and a half pounds. Let me put a picture up right now of that uh, for the Virginia Tech. Uh, they did an experiment um, on like a five star experiment for like technology of helmets. This helmet is, it's really light. That's what I really like. You have a lot of mobility. You can like jump out, you know, it's like, it's really easy to get used to when you first put it on. So that's uh, definitely a good thing about it. Yeah, it's very light. I like that because you can't play if your neck is just always hurting. So that's very good. And then last is price. So picked, I already told you guys, pick this up for $165.95 on Amazon. That is, a, is an awesome price. For the helmet that you're getting, this is, yeah, for the helmet that you're getting, which is a very, very quality helmet, very safe helmet, a very light helmet, and a very inexpensive helmet, Zenith is doing a very good job on the X2B Plus. I think this is an awesome, definitely, definitely recommended helmet for you. If you're new to football, you want something cheap, you got, you don't want to break the bank, this is definitely the best option you can get, in my opinion, so far. This is definitely the best option. It is very safe. It, um, it has very good technology. I would definitely recommend this to get for the next season. Um, yeah, so on this review of the Zenith X2B Plus, I give this a five-star review of the X2B Plus. It is awesome, inexpensive, light, comfortable, and safe. This uh, checks all the boxes. Um, definitely recommend it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Before I go, I just want to say I need a revamp from my channel. So I need a channel banner, channel logo, and new intro. So if you guys can make that for me, one of you guys, comment down below and DM it to me at, at Jaboy Wagner. And uh, it'll be my Twitter. as my Twitter. DM it to me. And I will shout out you in the next video if you guys can make me a really cool one that I add to my channel. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, go drop a like, hit that sub button, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.